Warning, I swear a lot. Hello everyone, welcome back to Dark Souls 3. We just took down that knight flawlessly, I might add, with uh, very little effort on my part. That just didn't go very well. Ah. <laughs> Had a feeling it would kill me. Ah, like that. Now, 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 now. Oh, fuck, I didn't... I didn't capitalize. Okay, well, we're having this fight proper now, aren't we? Ow. You know, one shot, as I do. And now, we can go into a little area beyond him where we could find, like, I don't know, some loot, or a boss, or another knight, or all three, and not have to fight the other two. Are they knights? Like, was he, was the blue one a special knight and the red ones are just normal knights, or... I'm not sure how that works. Get out of my way, fuckface. No time for you, idiots. I'll make time for you. And that's because I care. And you. Need to remember how to use the mace. I've been playing too much Bloodborne. Ow. As is evident. Actually, we do have a test just over there. There is one knight I have to kill. So let's see if I can actually do it. I've just woken up and I'm groggy as fuck. So. Who's a bitch? There we go. It's a good start. Nice moves! Go on. Good stuff. See, I still got it. Cut it, I still have it. We're having a lot tangled with you right now, sir. No, thank you. Oh, your buddy's there too. Oh, it's just a big party with you guys, isn't it? A big old twat pie. Twats. Everywhere. <laughs> this looks like a boss fight. It might not be, but it looks like one. What do you have to say for yourself, guy? Or gal? Sorry, I can't tell from here. My eyesight's bad. Ah, it is a girl. The wait has been long. Lady. Sure, it has been. I am Emma, High Priestess of Lothric Castle. You do know this place is I fucked, won't right? Speak frankly. Go ahead. You will not find the Lords of Cinder here. They have left, gone. No. To their journey homes, converging at the base of this castle. Okay. Head to the bottom of the high wall. Okay. Forge on through the great gate. Yes. And raise this banner to proceed. Excellent. So if people tell stories about this particular endeavor, you could say it was a banner saga. If you don't know games, that means nothing to you. Desperately short on lore in this game. A small banner held by Lothric messengers hold up outside the main castle gate to be greeted by an escort. When the high wall appeared, the path to the undead settlement was blocked and messengers came bearing this banner. They were sent out with a duty, but had no way of returning. Dick move. Honest this dick move. Gift is for you. Ooh. Is it, it a level? Is the of an old covenant. Oh shit. If you fear trespassers, dark spirits drawn by the embers, then etch this upon your heart. That sounds painful. And the old concord will beckon noble blue sentinels oh. to hunt these foul spirits. So we've kept blue sentinels then. The way of blue is still very real. Okay. Does that provide me with any benefits? Pale sheepskin pa Hmm. Pale blue sheepskin parchment featuring an illustration of the moon, symbol of an ancient accord. Members of the Way of Blue are the beneficiaries of an ancient accord. When a dark spirit threatens them, a blue spirit will grant them assistance and help to root out the invader. Summoning takes place automatically while this is equipped. Well, I'm currently uploading a video, which means my internet is fucked, which means I'm currently playing offline. So, I don't think I'm going to need that right now. But beware. The dog keeps a close eye on things. Oh, there's a puppy sick. The vile watchdog of oh. the Boreal Valley. Oh. The vile watchdog is... That's not how you describe a nice pupper. Oh, that's not a stairs. I wish it was a stairs, but it's not. And that's not a stairs either. Okay, well, we discovered this. That's nice. I'm actually going to check to see if that blue knight respawned. Is he a one-off, or is he a constant thorn in my side? Let's have a look. Ah, he's still there! He's still kicking it old school. We're going to leave him the fuck alone. I fought him enough times. I mean, just the once. It was a one-shot, and I killed him in one go, clearly. As you guys saw. As you saw in that episode. Bring up the footage now of me killing him in one go. Do it. I like that. I didn't... Ow. Here's a frustrating thing, right? I've leveled up, and I have enough strength to wield the fucking halberd, but I don't have enough dex. I need more dex. I need more dex. Oh, there's two of them. Hey, buddy. How's it cracking? In fact, you can tell me how it's cracking. 
your bones. Ow. Okay, well, you, sir, have earned yourself a ticket to the naughty corner. There we go. Now, where were we? Oh, Esther, say. Eh? That's great. And it's immediately undone. What matters is that you tried. Well, these pilgrims are dead. This comes back to what I was saying before. They're undead, so surely they should just revive at the bonfire. Or well, the bonfire is not activated until my arrival, because I seem to be the only one who's fucking doing anything. Everyone else just seems to be wandering around and looking kind of miserable, as is the norm in Dark Souls world. Is that the gate that I have to use the banner for? It would stand to reason. It also looks like it leads outside. This is gonna be a boss. You boys ready for a boss fight? And girls, sorry, I don't like to discriminate. My character's like, oh, this is fucking bullshit. Look at that fucking bullshit over there, being bullshit. It's summoning bullshit. What's that smell? It's bullshit. Look at that bullshit. Is that the watchdog? Did they give him a mace? Can I have your mace? I'd like that mace. Alright, it's time for the first real boss, I guess. Vort of the Boreal Valley. Time for me to get wrecked. Alright, Vort, what do you got? Oh, this mace is amazing. I love this mace. Ow! Oof. I don't even know what that stats effect is. Ah! Frostbitten. Well, I'm dead, so it doesn't matter. Ah! Okay, immediately, that doesn't seem too bad. We do a lot of damage per hit. He does the very, very typical sort of newer Souls boss strategy of fast hit with slow follow-up. So you get cracked by the stinger, that's, you know, in Devil May Cry, that's the term for it, where they just charge forward and stab you. Stinger, followed by slow wind-up attack. You're mashing circle because you've just been hit by a fast one and you're expecting another fast one, and then they catch you mid-roll. It's literally timed to work that way. Ah! <laughs> go, go away! Go, go! go. NICE MOVES! Good news is this time I can just make that boss run like straight away because the elevator has now come up and I don't have to stand around and wait for it. Can you imagine in real life trying to get a an elevator upstairs and you're mashing the fucking button and you turn around and this fucking huge dude with an axe coming after you. You don't want that. Having some range on my two-handed switch. You motherfucker, do you realize I now have to heal before I go into that boss fight? Do you realize the inconvenience you've caused me? Do you realize I'm probably going to get clipped by one of those undead guys on my way in? Because that is going to happen. I guarantee it. Oh, no, not again! Fuck! That's great. That's, um, that's great. I've just wasted my mana. That's... That's great. That's great. That's great. This boss fight's gonna go well. Excuse me, sir. Pardon me, sir. Thank God you're spear wielders and therefore less aggressive. As is the norm for spear wielders. Alright, let's do this! Come on! Watching his movements. Don't get too far away, he'll do this stinger. Oh, I'm too good for you, bro. Oh, he's gonna do the stinger. Oh, he didn't do the stinger. I'm just waiting for the stinger. <laughs> just do it. Put me out of my misery. I hit you in the grundle, what are you gonna do now? Huh? Oh, that felt bad. Has he got another phase? Yes, he does. At least I thought he did. Oh no, 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 AoE, AoE. Oh no, he's just buffing. Okay, <laughs> oh, okay, all right, buddy. Okay, buddy, that's cool. That's always the funny thing about Dark Souls games, that um, in boss fights, usually, it honestly doesn't matter how many healing items you get, because the threat in a, in a soul, didn't think I was gonna get that in time. The threat in most Souls boss fights isn't that they'll work you down and you'll run out of healing items and then they'll kill you. Like, it's not a battle of attrition, it's a battle of you took a lucky hit, you're gone. Right? You'll end, like for instance in Bloodborne, being a fantastic example because you almost always have 20 blood vials, 20 healing items, you will usually lose a boss fight and have like 17, 18 blood vials left. Because the challenge isn't... 
beating him before your health items run out. Like I said, it's not getting hit by a lucky strike and dying. It's a picture, if you like. Picture a boxing match, right? But, um... You, you fight the enemy, you have to do the jabs and the fucking counters and shit, and you have to work him down. Meanwhile, he hits you with one, and you're gone. That is the idea behind this, basically. Is there more poison? I could do more. I could do more physical damage and frost resist. Oh, oh but it's a fucking, it's, oh, shows off my skinny ankles. I don't want that. This is fashion souls. Let's see how this goes. I'm not really learning his attacks either. That's part of the issue here. Alright, you prick. Oh, sir. How how rude. What the fuck are you doing? The worst part is, is due to my commitment to actually present this properly. I can't edit out my failures. Even ones as embarrassing as that one. I have to just sort of be like, yeah, no, that's what happened. <laughs> like, that's often why people do this pre-recorded instead of streaming cells, but I don't believe in covering up my failures, because that's part of the viewing experience. I'll edit out a lot of stuff beforehand so it's not painfully slow to watch, but the actual death, no, I'll leave that in, because you guys need to know that I'm not as good as I say I am, and I never said I was that good to begin with anyway. I bet I'll get clipped by these guys if I try to skip them, but... By the same token, I'm not fighting them every single time. <laughs> Maybe you should get better with that crossbow there, young man. Or oh, young lady, it's honestly impossible to tell with a corpse. Unless you really want to get into the anatomical details, and I don't, so we won't. Excuse me, sirs, I've got a date with Volt. 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 Why did I think his name was Volt? Whatever. Volt. Come on, Volt. Hey, Vort. Vort. Come on, Vort. Hey, Vort. Oh. Oh. Okay. Okay, sir. Okay. May as well drink that. Hey, Vort. I've got time. Alright, heal. Now's the time to heal. That was exactly the time to heal. I don't know what he's doing. What are you doing, sir? Please stop. Now's the time. Okay, well... <sighs> Alright, that's one of those really irritating boss fights where what they decide to do is start the boss fight fairly simple and then really ramp it up for the second phase. Which is just irritating because it's misleading. And it's also irritating because the second phase, that's what I want to learn to fight. That is what I want to focus on, but I still have to get through the first phase in order to get there. My time spent with Ludwig really <laughs> made me tired of multiple phase boss fights. Like, I just want to fight the hardest one immediately. Get it over with. I want to learn. Like, um, there we go. I, t I spoke about this with my brother before, but when you have multiple phases and the last phase is the hardest one where you constantly get killed, it has an effect on your memory of the fight, and I like to call it the cupped water effect. Where, essentially, right, literally, right now, as I'm heading back towards the boss fight, I'm losing details in my memory of that second boss fight. Right? Like cupping water in your hands. Bits are spilling out. The longer it takes for me to get back there, and then I have to fight him down to that point again, all this time, throughout all this time, details are slipping through the cracks. I'm forgetting tells, I'm forgetting how far an attack will go, I'm forgetting how many times you will do it, how much damage it does. All these details, and it's frust- it's- I know, it's a challenge, it's supposed to be a challenge, but it's frustrating when you're like, I just want to learn to fight the boss, that's it. I don't want handouts, I don't want unfair advantages, I just want to learn how to fight him. But I have to go through this crap first. And I might even die here, who knows? It can easily happen. 
he does a fair bit of damage. Can't see. Ugh. That should have killed me. That really should have killed me. Come on, Vort. Come on, Vort. What are you doing? I have to really try and chance a heal. Because I'm not going to survive the second phase like this. Ah! Oh yeah! Get fucked. Now I have to not waste it. There we go. Now for round two. Alright, I remember this from fucking Ludwig. I'm Frostbeard. Well, that's bad. Ah! You wanna know something embarrassing? I thought I'd run out of Estus. It wasn't until literally, I think, two seconds before I was killed that I realized I hadn't run out of Estus. Problem was, they have that fucking change to the fucking icon where it's like, oh, you're running out of Estus. All I saw was a green bottle, so I was like, I'm out, I'm empty. I don't exactly have a lot of time to look down there and scan for that tiny number next to it. So, I thought I'd run out. That's why I tried to go for the clerical heal rather than, you know, just drinking. Which would have made a lot more sense. Ugh. Let's do this again. I'll try to concentrate. And remember that I haven't run out of Estus when I actually have it. Come on, Vort. Go play it chill. Get it? Cause he's covered in ice. Shut up, Grandma! Oh, ah, nice. That's the plan, honestly. Is that once I can use the halberd, I'm just gonna start sinking points into uh, stamina. Because I am sick. I, the idea that I could dodge once, swing once, and then it's like, oh, I better back off from low on stamina is fucking absurd. How am I supposed to kill this guy if I can only hit him once? Every time. That always gets me. Alright, time to drink. Every fucking time! Good god. Oh, he's doing the thing. Time to get some th free shots in. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. No, not that way. Not that way. Reconsider. Ah. Uh, I have no stamina. I have no sta- Ah! Uh. Oh fuck, I saw it coming! I did! I saw it coming! Ah! My brain just did not piece it together. It's not as if I have an actual damaging miracle I can use. That'd be too much. I hope to god the miracles in this aren't like they are in fucking Dark Souls 2, where they are just useless. Because that'll be really upsetting. 
that I've decided to go with a fucking cleric build in a game where they've been nerfed to oblivion. Seriously, if you played Dark Souls 2, that shit was tragic. Try playing a cleric build on Dark Souls 2 now. If you're good enough, you'll probably get through, but you'll get through because of your melee prowess, not because of your fucking miracles. After a while, you'll just stop using them, except for heal. Heal is the only useful miracle now, really. I think there are some others that are probably pretty decent, but for, the point is, Lightning Spear is now fucking useless. You know, the attack that Gwyn used to take down the dragons? I don't know how he did that, because the spell's pathetic. Alright, you fuck. I have to cough. <coughs> oh. Oh. oh, wrong Estus Flask, fuck. I can barely see. It's only luck that that didn't hit me. I really can't see right now. You guys see the issue here, right? Or more to the point, you can't. We got some free hits in. What else could I really do? Ah! It's annoying, because honestly by this point, the easier thing to do and the smarter thing to do would be to go somewhere else, get a little stronger, come back, and beat him that way. But the thing is, I know I can beat him now. I absolutely 100% know I can beat him right now. I just need to get good. Ah, ah, he said it! He said it! Easy. Actually easy. When you concentrate, when you actually focus, that is actually easy. You just gotta... nice. <sighs> Fun though. He's a good boss. Can't say he's not a good boss. You just gotta concentrate. You gotta shut the fuck up. <laughs> you gotta stop talking to your imaginary audience that actually doesn't exist. And just focus.